Okay. Hi guys, Max here. Gonna bring you guys now the veteran expedition version of Deep Space Exploration. So press N, bring up our content finder, expeditions, and veteran expedition, deep space exploration. Check our role, DPS, do not find others. So the scales from one to five players, join fight, insta queue. Okay, so when we get inside here, first we need to talk to six crew members. And they'll be on your radar here, these these dots here on your radar. You go through, talk to him, to your right, got a robot, to your left, got the lop here. And we go on up, and to your right, over here, we got this guy. Plain simple. And then we got this guy here. Someone wants you to check in with him, yeah? And this one here. Get into the ring. Talk to this one here, to the captain. And then you can just sit here and wait as, you know, everything crashes in and falls apart around you. And this guy's losing his mind. He thinks he's about to be sick. Dude, we're in space. Don't puke. That's not cool. Now there's an armada of Ichthian battle cruisers here to um, assault our friendly, peaceful deep space exploration vessel. How dare they! So now we're in a cage, and we've got a guard here who's sleeping, and we won't wake him up. So we're just gonna taunt him. Don't bang on the cage or knock yourself out. Mm -hmm. Just taunt him. Just insult his mama. Or his. Yeah, I guess they have mamas. Maybe they don't. I'll have to ask Gary about that one. Yeah, you're ugly. Get over here. Now he wants to kill me. Mm hmm. Let's me out, but that is his undoing. And down he goes. Okay, now as I pointed out in the normal version of this video, if you guys want to get the numbers to actually let these guys out instead of killing them, if you put your mouse over, it'll tell you the number to punch in for each access code. 3596. 3596. There's also a lore book just right in here to your left that you can grab and it will also give you the access keys to each of these cells. But whether you let them out nicely or whether you just blow them up, doesn't really matter. <laughs> Just access them all. Sorry, raw stars. I let the greedy Protoss live. Okay, so now we're gonna come in here. We're gonna access security interface. And now, fight off these guys. Our objectives here. One of the bonus objectives is to use the Ichthian guns, and they are on the ground here, so you have to get close enough to grab them, and you have to use them on the Ichthians, and I recommend using them either on this guy here that I just killed, or on these guys right here, because they're the stronger of the mobs, but also it's a good idea to save some of them for the bosses as well because they will help you kill the bosses a lot faster. So, we can kill them, and we also have to rescue the crew, we have to kill Iron Tide Venom Snake, we have to collect Engineer Clamps parts, and clog the ship. So, first, I would recommend going here to the left. Going to this room, and we're gonna get these parts, and we're gonna clog up the engines first. And grab his part right there. And there's another Ichthian weapon on the ground there. Which is great. Okay. But we're gonna save that. 
clear our way to that room. Oh, grabbing this part right here. Right, and there's another part on the ground, and you'll see the engine pieces. You have to grab these and then throw them in the engines. But there's three guys in this room, and Stormraker here. This guy is one of the tougher guys, so I'd recommend using the weapon on him and shrink him down, <laughs> and it makes him a lot easier to kill. Down he goes. And these guys here, these are just not super light mobs, but not as tough as the as the named guy that I just killed there. <laughs> They'll die much faster. And you pretty much have to clear this room just to be able to get to all this stuff in here. Down he goes. So, grab this, hook it in the engine, grab this, hook it in the engine, and this is one of the robot's parts, and this is to clog the engine, but we need to grab the other robot part and it's up on top of that there, so get on top of here, and just jump, get on top of there, no problem. Grab the robot part. Clog the engine. Robot part. And one more engine. Okay, so we've got all of the all the robots parts, we've clogged all the engines, and once you had all the parts, you have to come over to this table and you have to assemble the robot. And now he's assembled. And it's another weapon. And take this. Yes, keep that. Watch over the laser beams. And we clear that room. And come out here. And go to our left. And down you go. I'm going to save that weapon right there, since I, I have this and I can walk past these guys. There's there's more weapons than you really need. These guys aren't that strong. And I've used two out of the five that I need for that optional objective. So there's another weapon right there to the right. I'll use this one here. You. Shrink you. this gun and now I have to rescue the forces rescue my crew members and they're being guarded by these ichthians so I have to kill the ichthians rescue wake up you're free kill the fish people Or the bigger guy. And there we go. You, my friend. Get up. Kill the guards. Okay, 
Okay, so now I've got a weapon, and this guy here, this is Ironhide's Venom Snake right here, and I would recommend saving a weapon to use on him. Keep them for the name mobs. Yeah. They'll die faster. Okay, down he goes, and rescue the rest of my crewmen. Double kill. Double kill. Grab a weapon, thank you. Four of my five weapons. Okay, and the last guy's in the middle of the room here. Particles from the space chase event. Alright. So now this room's clear. So we can run it through here. We don't have to kill every single mob that's on the way. Just clear the path. And come to your left. But sometimes that chew a tail. That chew a tail can bring stragglers. And that was just poor aim. Serves them right for getting in the way. Okay, so let's use the weapon on one of these guys since there's none on the ground there. And that's the five weapons used. But since they're helpful, we can use more than five. You don't have to use just five, you can use more than five if you want, absolutely. They are there to help and assist you. And now we have to kill Captain Rotfin. And that's right, we're going to use one of these weapons on him as well. We have to fight our way in. Okay, and I recommend killing this guy, this wandering guy here, because he'll come and interrupt you while you're trying to fight the captain, and he'll start casting that area effect spell stuff. It hurts. It's not nice. Kill him. And if you want to kill the rest of the ads in this room, make it a little safer while you're fighting the captain, go for it, but uh, make sure you at least kill that one guy. Oh yeah, and use the gun on him. There we go. Nah, no, you're tiny. Nah. No. <laughs> Well, I pulled them anyway. Okay, now we have to get to that access panel, and he's guarding it. Let's fix that. Fantastic. Okay, another game of Simon says, no problem, orange, orange, blue. Blue, green, green. Okay, now I have to get to the escape hatch, so back out. Into the blue circle. And you can just wait here for a second. Now things start blowing up. You can press escape and skip this part. Things are going to blow up, but we're going to fix it. Okay, so now we have to restore the life support systems and access the maintenance control drones. 
So you have to access this panel here. Now you're a drone. Now you're in zero G. And if you can, use your mouse look for this. It'll make it a little bit easier. Okay, and use your forward thrusters mostly to, to get through here and try to dodge as much floating debris as you can. And if you hit some debris and you get damaged, you can repair your bot at one of these repair stations, these maintenance room repair stations. But you want to go in through this room to the left. And then to your right here, we'll start with this panel. And make sure you left click the glowing panel, get close enough, and press 1. And repair to turn around. Another one right behind you. Oh, pink. And repair. Now back into the middle. Almost like a little T. And then right in the center of the room, here's another one. And then if you look just a little bit to your left, there's one right over here. Okay, and then a little bit to your right and down. At the back of the room over here. There's one. Okay, and then a bit to your right and up is going to be one over here. And they're also marked on your radar here by these dots if you wanted to, if you're really confused, if you get lost or spun around. And then you're going to go down here, knock that out of the way because it's in our way. Go into this room, and there's two more right in here. So we're going to repair this, turn around, the one's right here, repair. And if you guys are doing the space chase event and trying to get ego particles, because this expedition has so many bonus objectives, doing them all and getting a gold medal will give you the most ego particles per run. So if you can blast your way through, this is really the best way to get eco particles for the space chase event. So now we're going to access the airlock hatch. Why are you getting knocked down? Oh no, and now we're all dazed and disoriented, dazed and confused. I'm gonna run through the door, and we want to freeze these these dinosaurs that keep clawing at the ship. And they're letting all the air out. So go up to them, and you have to press T. I'm gonna press T. Click them with your mouse and press T, and then you'll shoot your gun. you and these guys shoot all the guys here on like the main floor you don't have to get every single one in this room just get all the ones on that bottom floor there and then jump up in here get into this next room and then there's more guys up here and we're gonna shoot you Boop. and over here get you eight seven go through here and we're gonna shoot you Boop. and that's all of them so now Defense control switch deactivate the laser grid. Gather at the laser gather at the defense control grid to activate the laser defense grid. And that's this thing here. So now we got a mission impossible our way through this grid, and it might seem impossible, but it's not. So to make it a little easier if you want, you can go like look like this. See, and then you can actually see the beams. It makes it easier. And then just double jump and go over. Jump. 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 Double jump. Oh, Double jump. There we go. Back. Yeah. Jump. And then we turn around. Just run up this. And go over. Yeah. There you go. And we're in. Hooray! Now the beams are gone. Now we can run up into this and get on top of here. Go up into this room. Get up into there, you chua. With your short legs. Get in there. Go to your right. <laughs> we're gonna run up this, and we're gonna turn off these valves. Two there, and then if you go back the same way you came, you can run across this, this vent right here to the other side, and here's the other three. Now the last objective is to kill Riptide Stone Serpent, and he's this big guy right here in the middle of the room. If you haven't buried that out yet, down ya! 
You picked the wrong ship to invade, man. Down he goes. Eco particles. You flip the switch. And press escape, skip cinematic. And now we're disoriented again, but we're gonna keep on going forward and just now run to the end. Run to the orange circle at the end. Whatever that is. Hooray, gold! Achievement granted! Achievement granted, alright. And that is a gold run through veteran deep space exploration with the medic so if you guys like this segment and there will be the uh fragment zero as well we'll have the normal and the veteran versions of those coming up they'll be the last ones for this for this series okay hope you guys enjoyed like and share with your friends tell them all about it